All right, folks, as promised, I've got a poem here for you. Uh, I don't know if I'll continue reading these for you or uh, let them read, let you guys read them on your own, but there is a PDF in Google Classroom posted of this so that you can either follow along as I read it or uh, shut me off and, and read it to yourself. So this is to David about his education, and it's by a poet named Howard Nemirov. The world is full of mostly invisible things, and there is no way but putting the mind's eye or its nose in a book to find them out. Things like the square root of Everest, or how many times Byron goes into Texas, or whether the law of the excluded middle applies west of the Rockies. For these and the like reasons, you have to go to school and study books and listen to what you are told and sometimes try to remember. Though I don't know what you will do with the mean annual rainfall on Plato's Republic or the calorie content of the diet of worms such things are said to be good for you, and you will have to learn them in order to become one of the grown-ups who sees invisible things neither steadily nor whole, but keeps gravely the grand confusion of the world under his hat, which is where it belongs, and teaches small children to do this in their turn. Okay, folks, so you've got your audio of the poem and you've got your PDF in Google Classroom. So what are you going to do with this now? Take it through a says means matter like we've been doing out throughout this trimester so far. Think of what the poet Howard Nemirov is telling us in the poem. That's, that's your says, exactly what's on the page. What does it mean, okay? Think to yourself, who is this David that is in the title? And why might he need a message like this? Uh, and then lastly, and perhaps most importantly, what is the matter of this, okay? Why does this poem have any relevance to you in your life or in you know, contemporary society, all right? As I said in my um, email from yesterday, write up a Google Doc and submit it to the assignment that I've got in classroom there, and uh, we'll see what you have to say about it, okay? So, enjoy. Hopefully, this will um, have some relevance to you, and I look forward to seeing what you, what you all submit, all right? Have a good afternoon. Talk to you tomorrow.